All right, folks. Well, it's Friday, so you know we have a zoo guest. And joining us today is Jacob Tamayo with the Gladys Porter Zoo. And who did you bring with us today? Well, today I brought with me Chinzilla the Chinchilla, <laughs> which to me is just the coolest chinchilla name that you know chinchilla. you could ever have. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so he is actually, uh, he's a rodent. These chinchillas are found in the Andes Mountains, most likely, or more in like Chile. Okay. About, and that's where they're from. Uh, they're native, or they're native to there. Uh, a few interesting facts about them. They're a little bit nocturnal. These guys are uh, mostly active at dawn and dusk. Okay. Um, a big thing that people always like talk about with chinchillas is how soft their fur is. Yes. And if you want to touch them right here, I know, you can just they're get. So soft. We were doing this a little bit right before we yes. came on right now. So it's like a little plush animal, it's yeah, like a little no. plush toy. Mm -hmm. It's their most distinguishing feature, but it's also one of the things that makes them um, just a little bit more special, especially in the wild. Uh, in, in the wild, they're uh, critically endangered. Oh, Over really? the last 15 years, we've seen a global population a global population loss of about like 90%, oh, wow. and that's mostly from hunting. Um, wow. Obviously, with soft fur like this, people mm -hmm. want to hunt them, not specifically for their meat, but a lot of the times for their fur. Yeah. And, you know, they're just very delicate creatures. They have to be handled, you know. Very carefully. Yeah, very carefully as well. A lot I, of people want to have these as pets. So. Really? I yeah. mean, they are so cute. So, of course, now I know that his, his whiskers are moving around, and we were just talking about them before. Yeah. We were just talking about his whiskers, and you can see right here, they're really long, almost about yeah. half the length of his body. Mm -hmm. And the reason for that is because chinchillas have a little bit of underdeveloped eyes, probably lending um, to the fact, you know, that they're nocturnal, so they mm -hmm. don't have to see in the light very too much. So they use their whiskers kind of as like a, a second or another sense, really, to like feel around in their, where they are. And that's why you see that he's doing that little cute little nose thing. <laughs> I thought that they were little kisses, but it's just him You're trying like, to feel oh, around. he's just trying to feel around. Yeah, You're like, I thought Aw. that he loved me a little bit more. <laughs> How cute. Now, is this about as big as he's going to get, or does he get bigger than this? Yeah, this is actually a larger chinchilla. Oh, wow. Which is, I mean, his name, Chinzilla. He's one of the larger <laughs> ones that we have there at the zoo. Um, but they'll typically get around this size, the males, um, just okay. a little bit smaller maybe for the females. Wow, so cute. And their little paws are just so oh, tiny. They're, they're I mean, they're paws. so... I, just, I have to have them here just on the, the palms of my hand here because I don't want to be you know, I, too brisk with them or anything like that and no, make them squirrel they're away. So tiny. But he's very comfortable. This guy's a... He loves the spotlight. Definitely. Yeah. Now, do you guys have any events coming up over at the zoo? We do. On Janu or February 7th, we have our Winter Texan Appreciation Day coming up. And any Winter Texans that show up, they'll have a discounted price of four fifty, and we'll be offering um, train tours. Uh, oh, nice. Just get there around the zoo, and it's a lot of fun. We love having our visitors from out of state every year. Perfect. Yeah, and we love seeing them. Of course, and they can come visit Chinzilla. Yeah. Chinchilla. Well, <laughs> well, Chinzilla won't be the one um, on exhibit okay. at the zoo, but you can you can definitely check out our chinchillas and our small world exhibit there at the zoo. Perfect. Okay. Well, thank you all so much for coming in today. Thank you, Gabby. Well, folks, we will be back in about two minutes.